my number one memory will always be uh, just how giving sharukh was as a co-actor you know he he had this scene with me and there was no need for him to be like um you know he 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 was willing you know like he was he was conveying to me what actually he wanted uh, and he was oh. telling me he was trying to break it down for me and i was like my god he reminds me of one of my co-actors you know like you know how we would be with each other that yeah. okay main tujhe samjhati hu or i would tell you you know like how barun and i would be i take whatever opportunity that comes my way and i make something of it that's that's been my entire career so even tiger 3 was more like you know i got i got a call from shanu and uh, honestly it was very simple straight for me that uh, of course there was we know tiger 3 is salman khan um, but for me it was um, you know that uh, manish is directing it and i have i've known him i've known him before i don't know him now it's not like we hang or anything i haven't seen him ever since he became a big director all right so uh, well, welcome riddhi to uh, this chat with news 8 in shosha my name is shriyanka mazumdar and uh, right Hi. now uh, right now the it movie the it person thank you so much for joining us and uh, tell you. us uh, this this hysteria has it sunk in yet no and it shouldn't i want the hysteria to continue as as someone who was a part of this project and someone who loves sharukh i'm just yeah. so i you know i i'm always happy when his films do well uh, you know it's a very silly <laughs> thing but you know we all feel like oh the whenever he he comes out with a film that's massive and it's huge you know and and people love it we feel so good that you know yes of course he's our favorite and everyone's loving him um, but this yeah. time because i'm a part of it it's surreal mm-hmm. it's overwhelming it's it's um, like god pinch me like god has to come and pinch me nobody else <laughs> will do you know i i can't believe that this uh, victory is personal you know it's not just uh, the, for you know my favorite uh, actor but it's also like i'm part of it and uh, you know i i'm so happy for the director i'm so happy for atlee because i've seen him at work i'm so happy for the entire crew who was there so this this feels amazing and i do not want the hysteria to settle and you know uh, like you said that this this uh, this thing is so personal you know i was watching this video the other day where you guys were dancing on stage you know to not remind you <laughs> and he was holding your hand did, did that you know <laughs> even throughout the course of the film because you're such a fan girl you know apart from you know, a person artist and um, you know i've read those interviews and when i watched that video i saw him kind of you know holding your hand and dancing and i could see that that in your face you know were there <laughs> of such disbelief that okay this is happening on sets also you know i know phones were not allowed and everything but you know did it did it occur in your mind that okay what is happening am i in a film with him i was standing with him or in between takes you know when there was a scene with every actor and you know i was also there it was uh, it was something else you know the, the feeling of but i had to you know see the thing is that when you sign up to be an actor you also have to be professional <laughs> yeah so i had to always keep that uh, on the side and i had to always keep yeah. those feelings a little like you stay latent right now you just yeah. be you know in the corner somewhere we'll go home and we'll chill and we'll have, we'll do everything that we want to <laughs> but right now just behave yourself and yeah. i don't think i could hide that very well on the jawan event day um, <laughs> i think it was it was pretty evident i didn't have a cover yeah. up of a character to go behind it was just me and he extended his hand and i was like yes i'm yeah. coming <laughs> i went running to yeah, yeah what do i do yeah yeah so it was uh, it was amazing and there was a lot of disbelief i mean uh, but it was good disbelief and it was like uh, you know it gives you unki movie ka dialogue hai but it's also something that rumi says oh you know we've heard the secret and everything that you know when you want something badly or what you seek is seeking you um yeah. you know if you want something bad enough the universe gives it to you so it just proves those things right and i i feel like okay i've got to keep going and this is i'm not even touched the tip of what i want to do so um i th- these are just uh, uh, sort of really encouraging uh, moves for me and i feel like uh, i need to you know nail ace ace whatever comes my way because i uh, till now whatever i wished for is is happening you know speaking of uh, touching just the tip of the iceberg um you you working in in tiger 3 as well i know uh, you might not be able to divulge as much but you know like they say from one khan to the other from one superstar to <laughs> the other 
So um, in terms of, you know, approach, um, how, how similar or different are they? Because since you worked with both of them in very, uh, in a very close span of time. I wouldn't be able to tell you how different they are because I've not really, uh, I don't know them personally. So I, I cannot sit and tell you, oh, you know, this is what. Um, see, I, I'll tell you as an actor, uh, when I'm on set, I don't really like, I, I when I'm, I'm on a set that I'm probably a lot invested in, I don't like being disturbed a lot and I don't have the bandwidth for it. So I did not really, apart from getting to spend the time with them because because of the scenes I didn't really interfere disturb or you know like what are they doing what is he doing I didn't really do that but uh, so I just saw similarities I because that's what um, I think what I took away from both of them were how similar they were in the sense that they were both uh, they both had that childlike quality in them to to act and to be a part of a team as a team um they were never, they were never like starry or, you know, like I'm the star. You never felt that, you know, you felt like you could go up to them and you could talk to them and you could crack a joke and, you know, you could just sit with them and chill with them. With both of them, I feel that. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I wouldn't be able to tell you, uh, you know, I feel like maybe if I do some more work with them, then I'll be able to tell you the similarities and differences. But uh, for, as for my first experience with, you know, um, it was um, it was incredible to just be a part of a, a unit where they are there because... Yeah they are there for a reason, you know, apart from the love that you, the, I mean, the audience gives them love because of how giving they are as actors. And these are yeah. things which, because they are so popular and so famous, we don't end up talking about these things, you know, even, even yeah. in popular media, these things don't get spoken about because there's just, they are brands, right? They are like, yeah. you know, part of pop culture, but uh, yeah. they are just basic, uh, you know, pure giving actors and artists. Yeah. And for me, yeah. where I am, uh, that's hugely motivating and encouraging and a lot to learn uh, from both of them. And and what would you say was your, like, a memory that has an indelible effect on your mind? You know, it's something that you will never be able to forget from the sets of Joanne. Uh, there's lots, everything I've seen on Javan, you know, like, yeah, but I think my number one memory will always be uh, just how giving Shah Rukh was as a co-actor, you know, he, he had this scene with me and there was no need for him to be like, um, you know, he, he, he was willing, you know, like he was, he was conveying to me what actually he wanted uh, and he was oh. telling me, he was trying to break it down for me. And I was like, my God, he reminds me of one of my co-actors, you know, like, you know, how we would be with each other. That, yeah. okay, I would tell you, you know, like how Barun and I would be or, you know, just like, and yeah. I had just done work with, and Barun is also a Delhiite. So I had done, I know yeah. some Delhiites who are actors and I know how they are. So Shah Rukh reminded me a lot of, <laughs> uh, you know, everyone I know. So it just goes out to show how basic and how uh, simple he truly is. Yeah. And, uh, you know, he wrote down the scene for me and he told me, you do it like this, you know, this is what they want. And actually, if you see the first line that I've spoken, I've spoken it exactly yeah. like Shah Rukh. So <laughs> he said, say it like this, because, you know, they're, they're, yeah. it's also going to be dubbed in South Indian. There is a particular yeah. way I understood that dialogues yeah. are being said. So I remember Shah Rukh said, say it like this. And I just looked yeah. at him and he was saying it. And I tried my, I said, I'm going to do my best to do it exactly like that. And what I have done is I've exactly done what Shah Rukh, uh, you know, sort of told me to do. Um, but he was so helpful. He was aware that you are this big, big fan of his. I tried my best to behave myself and to be like, <laughs> I'm a professional actor, but I couldn't in the process of filming that scene. I yeah. think he must have understood that I'm a big fangirl and he knows some people I know. So I made sure that, I, I mean, you know, you can't be fangirling when you're at work. It's it's really Absolutely. like, it, yeah. it, it can also yeah. make the other person a little uncomfortable. So I made yeah. sure that outside uh, the people that know him, <laughs> sort of give him the message that he's a big fan. <laughs> so long as he's aware that you are... I mean, he should be because I, I I mean, I wanted him to be. I'll tell you why. Because I was too shy. I just didn't talk to him. Yeah. So he would either feel like, not him, but like if yeah. if someone is a very big fan and that yeah. person never talks to you and you don't know, you'll never know, right? So it yeah. was important for me to send that message to him because yeah. for him, it'll be like, okay, this girl doesn't talk and she's just in her own yeah. world. That's not yeah. true. Uh, you know, I'm like uh, just thinking about you and what all I should say and then say ending up saying nothing. 
<laughs> but you know uh, you have you uh, you come a long way from your television days now you're uh, on ott doing really good projects and now of course um, a part of uh, such a big uh, film uh, you know and of course child three is lined up so do you think now in terms of you know the kind of range that you have from also straddling different media now do you think the industry is kind of uh, taking a note of it do you think jawan kind of catapulted that effect i wouldn't know till i i'll honestly say that i am um, i i don't wait for things to happen i sort of i mean it's it's i try and make things happen for myself because uh, i uh, so when i when you say that you know now do you think now you know people have i don't know i would not know if someone comes up with a great script uh, and you know i i i mean i hope that happens uh, but honestly i'll be honest um, I, i i'm always the one to break um, Uh, you know barriers between mediums or even like when i was doing television i was i was undoing a lot of things television also required uh, i was constantly fighting on every set that i'll not do this i'll do it this way let me make it better just see it it'll i'll put my mind to it so i was my my point is that i will wherever you take me i'm going to grab the opportunity and make yeah. the most of it uh it's for the people i wish that there are more and more people in the industry and i know the audience does not have any such sort of um, they don't they're not close minded i am an audience i know that i i would want to see any actor in any medium i don't mind so i know audiences are not close minded and i've worked in various mediums to know that um yeah but i do hope that the industry sort of says uh, that yeah i i you know i want to i i would like to like the people who have i mean it's a huge uh, huge push for me that atli uh, sees something in me uh, you yeah. know like uh, even now when i meet him he tells me wait you know a good script is going to come your way you wait uh, you know so these these things or when i was doing so uh, i'm sorry i'm cutting you but speaking of you know jawan do this there's so much uh, <laughs> noise about that you know are you expecting to kind of um, if if the script so demands uh, would you would you like to be a part of that have you had i would of- love to be a part of anything atli does and he knows it yeah. uh yeah. yeah of course i mean now that he's my friend now <laughs> we have a bro <laughs> we have both bros so uh, you know um Yeah I mean I was just casually very casually it was a joke I remember I was yeah. uh, you know he was very kind enough to have us all over uh, to you know sort of um, get together and he was just asking me politely as a host do you want anything and I said yeah a full fledged role in our next film. <laughs> I said as an athlete you telling somebody do you want anything and the person says this like yeah. that's the dream so um <laughs> you know so whatever he wants me to do i will happily and it's an honor and an absolute privilege that i even have this space with him where i can talk about him in this light um you know so i i what i'm what i'm trying to say is you know with you saying that with jawan has thing have things changed the fact that an atli see something in you also like you know that means so much yeah. to you, to me you know so when um, when he uh, wanted to meet me that's in 2022 uh that day i felt like okay there's something i'm doing right or there's yeah. something right about me so yeah you know i i mean it's only onwards and upwards from here and i'm going to keep doing my best or you know when sharuk on stage says what he says uh, for you which i have on record yeah. you know these are things that's that boost you and you know yeah. and unfortunately you are playing his brother yeah <laughs> and next time we'll do something uh, more uh, like age yeah. wise so uh, you know these things give you the boost to push yourself you know like uh, i i'm not the one to settle and say ah bas ab to ho gaya you know i i'm the yeah. one to say okay you know what maybe i'll go and do some acting workshop maybe i'll unlearn you know i i'm already like you know what should i do next what should i do to push this what sh- what should i do to be uh, you know worthy of bigger challenges uh, yeah. so i i always work like that i i like to push myself and i like to you know uh, make sure that i am ready to add value to whatever the size of the project is and uh, yes. nothing is big or small for me so yeah i i hope things change but that's for the industry they they need to say okay come yeah. on let's let's take her and you know speaking of a uh, director who is a friend uh, coming to manish sharma uh, he is uh, he's a friend of yours and you know what are the kind of expectations yeah. uh, you have just you among us 
Yes, it's it is humongous, and we hope that there's another super duper super duper hit, uh, you know, coming up. Yeah. And uh, and uh, no, I I honestly, like I said, you know, that I take whatever opportunity that comes my way, and I make something of it. That's that's been my entire career. So even Tiger Three was more like. you know i got i got a call from shanu and uh, honestly it was very simple straight for me that uh, of course there was we know tiger three is salman khan um, but for me it was um, you know that uh, manish is directing it and i have i've known him i've known him before i don't know him now it's not like we hang or anything i haven't seen him ever since he became a big director i've seen, met him um, uh, you know socially uh, but um, I was just uh, very very grateful that I I was getting this opportunity to be directed by him and to be on a set where he's working and uh, whatever it is you know um the the what uh, the part that I'm doing I'm just see I'm I'm here to live life I'm here to as an actor thrive and do you know I don't want to let go of any opportunity so I did uh, you know would you own the film that kind of see stars a shahrukh khan or a salman khan or a katrina kaif you know to even to that extent you know to hold your own in in whatever capacity in whatever the character is you know to make sure that the character has an impact through, yes through, yes you know, i hope so i hope yeah. so like 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 i mean that's what i'm saying these are the kicks that i get as an actor you know like why would i take up i was i i was doing so much work on ott when i when i signed up for these parts i remember i was doing asur shooting for mm-hmm. asur when i got a call for tiger uh, so you know yeah. when you're when you're doing this you know you you feel like do i need to uh, maybe someone else in my position would say no i'm i'm satiated i'm i'm happy i'm doing my work i don't need to do this but i have that extra thing of push yourself you know let's let's put myself in uncomfortable situations and let's see where it takes me i don't want to let go of any opportunity that comes my way and when the opportunities are The, the you know these like jawan yeah. and actually and sharukh yeah. and yashraj and manish and salman khan yeah. i'd be a fool i mean i'm 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 also a cinema lover so i i and i i'm a big supporter of theaters and going to the cinema and watching films in a cinema so if i'm getting to you know in a small way of course it's risky and all of that uh, considering yeah. you know everyone calculates what they want to do i have not really been the type to calculate i want to break every box that you can possibly put me in and then i want to confuse you so much that you're like okay forget it can't put her in any box <laughs> well to taking more boxes thank you so much riddhi for joining us on new vision showtime all the very best for your upcoming thank you so thank you so thank much you. thank you nice talking thank to you, you.